guys, what's up? Welcome back to our channel. I'm saying me and Stephanie, Christmas vibes. That's what I was about to say. Oh, really? Yeah. Maybe it's because we're meant to be. Maybe it's because we're Pisces. We should probably kiss. That way people can say when it's... How you guys doing today? I just literally just got off work not too long ago. I only work one day, you guys, on like... I, I mean to call it like my real job because... It's not a real job. Because, because I don't like it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's a scam. It just it just pays my bills, you know what I'm saying? But like some bills. But that that's why I only work one day if that sometimes we give up our shifts. That should be a skill. I don't know, shut your pieces. I don't know, but sometimes we do give it up. Sometimes we only work one, maybe two days. Who knows? But for the most part, we try to do YouTube. So thank you guys so much for supporting us. If you guys are new here, make sure to subscribe, turn on the post notification bell. That way you guys get notified when we do post a new video. No. Turn it on that way I can get a new uh, throat. So it is 106 degrees today, and it might look crazy because I'm wearing a freaking long sleeve, but I have an explanation. It is because we are going to be meeting up with our friends, and we're gonna be watching a movie, and you know how movie theaters can get really cold in there? Hopefully it's cold, because I like it to be fresh, like really cold, and I could just be like warm with a little like long sleeve, or you know, just something, something warm. I like that, you know? And yeah, so this is what my outfit is looking like. Don't mind this freaking thing, but I'm wearing Jesus's long sleeve. He just got this from Nike, but look how long it is actually. What's long? You see this? Oh yeah, it is, well it's a double X. I like, like, my, I like my stuff baggy. That shit, imagine on Stephanie. That shit said hang. I know, that shit said <laughs> curtain. No, but I like wearing long baggy stuff, you guys, because I love being like super comfy. I hate tight stuff. That's why you guys barely see me wear like- I love tight stuff. Tight jeans, yeah. like I don't like that. What'd you say? Huh. I'm just really excited for the popcorn, you guys. Hey, Sue. Like the diet popcorn that they have right there. I heard they're like really diet free. Hey, Sue has literally been saying that he's going to be on a diet and we're going to go back on the diet next video, next video. Even you guys are in the comments. You guys are like, you guys are making us laugh because like we've gone to Chili's, we've gone to BJ's, we've gone to Cheesecake Factory. I literally saw a comment just like that. Oh, really? Yeah. Don't worry, guys. We got a Diet Coke. We got all those wings and burgers, but we got a Diet Coke, so we're good. No, but I commented back on the on the comment and I was like, you know what? It's starting to become just like a thing that we say. Like, oh yeah, la dieta starts tomorrow. Like, I swear we're going to make like merch out of it one day. I know, but like I'm really going to start my diet on Tuesday. Like I already scheduled my appointments with my trainer. Yeah. So. so I don't know. I just feel like, I don't know. It's just like a lifestyle, you know, like it's just a fucking lie. Life happens. Like sometimes you just don't really want to continue something and you just don't care. You know what I'm saying? Like who cares? La dieta starts whenever. It could be just for a day. Who cares? Nobody cares. Shit. <laughs> but anyway, we're going to go watch a movie. Do you know what the movie's called? I forgot. A Quiet Place 2. A Quiet Place 2. So I'm super excited about that. We watched the first one and we loved it. But yeah, it's freaking hot outside. Yeah, it is. Anyway. All right, guys. So me and Stephanie are like really debating if we should spend $10 outside of the movie theaters or $176 inside <laughs> of the movie theater just on food and snacks. Literally, for two water bottles, a slushie, and probably a big old popcorn. $176. It's a mortgage payment. It's a car. It's literally the whole <laughs> freaking leg. No, like literally, guys, you have to give them your kidney stone just to get popcorn. <laughs> Kidney stone? I think a kidney stone. just a kidney, guys, not the kidney stone. Hopefully nobody gets kidney stones because those shits fucking hurt. <laughs> How about me? Yeah. Oh, you've never had one. I've but. never had it, but from the pain that I've seen from you, oh hell no. I'm wondering, you guys. All right. I don't know if I've asked you guys this question before, but those mothers that have had kids and have had kidney stones as well, what's more painful? Because people say that kidney stones are more painful or just as painful as, as birth. giving birth. Yeah. So I want to know because I've had kidney stones. And that shit hurts, you know what I'm saying? And obviously you've never given birth. And I've also given birth to Malachi. <laughs> no, that. Stephanie did and it hurt because it was a lot of hair. It was one hairy Maui. It just felt like sandpaper everywhere. <laughs> I'm just kidding on what I'm saying. No, did you know that some babies come out really hairy? Oh yeah, I know, uh-huh. Yeah. They already have a man bun, like they have the Lee guy in already. Do they have nails? Oh really? Yeah. Like they're done or what? They're like, no, like oh, they have my. little tiny nails. You know where I got that from? The movie Juno. Have you ever seen, seen that movie? No, I don't think I've ever seen that movie. The movie's really good. I like it. I've always liked watching it. I recently watched it again with my brother at my parents' house. Uh huh. And it's just good. It gave me like memories. Like I don't know. Like I just liked watching it. It was cool. It's about a uh, like a teenage girl who she becomes pregnant with this guy from high school. Uh huh. And like her parents never thought she was that active. You know. What do you mean by active? Active. What do you mean by that? Explain to him. So anyway. She ends up like giving the baby up for adoption. Adoption, yeah. So that seems like a great movie that I'll fall asleep to. Uh, no, it was cool. I don't know why. I just like. I think it's because I grew up watching the movie, so it was like a cool thing to rewatch. That's but. so cool, mi bonita. Yeah, 
Yeah. All right, guys, we made it. So can you give me a mask, please? So we're here at the Galaxy Theater. Let me just show you around. I'm saying it's been a while since this place has been open. So we're going to take you guys along with us to watch the movie. And honestly, just give you guys like the experience of what it's like now that we still have to wear masks, I think, you know, and just to like see what it's like inside. But like we really like this movie theater because they have cushion seats. Like you guys will see oh, like the yeah. cushion seats. I think we paid They're what? reclined. They can like go, go back. Down. Yeah. I just remember that like movie tickets were only like eight dollars to ten bucks, you guys. But this time it was like seventeen dollars. Yeah, it's like seventeen dollars per ticket. So I mean, it's yeah. a little bit more, but it's still not bad. You know what yeah. I'm saying? I don't know. It's not bad. I'm super excited. Oh yeah, those are friends. I already see hey, our friends. Can you, um, can you guys hear the music? Hey, hey, hey. What's up, brother? How you doing? What's going on? Oh, I like the shirt. Showing off the muscles, huh? Oh yes. Oh shit. All right. Love the smell of popcorn. It smells like buttery popcorn. I'm saying. What should we get? Let's see. We're, so we're definitely getting popcorn. Stephanie says she didn't want popcorn, but I know she's gonna have some. Uh, but like, look at those. Ices though, like nine dollars for an icy. Sign me up. Where? Oh Sign yeah, up. holy crap! Nine dollars? You can get you can get one for a dollar at the liquor store. You know that, right? Yeah. That's crazy, you guys. There was this one time where we did a video and we snuck in a whole bunch of snacks here inside of the Galaxy Theater, and it was stupid. Like we did like stupid shit. Like it was honestly funny. We'll put a link down below so you guys can go check it out. But it was hilarious. This is your captain speaking. So that was crazy. Like 30 minute movie. Thing, guys, so I literally just got out of the gym probably like 45 minutes ago. I'm still a little sweaty, you know what I'm saying? I'm feeling a little stinky, but you know the vibes. Um, I was gonna take you guys with me so you guys can see how I train and stuff like that. So I might do that in the future. Let me know if you guys want to see that. Yes, you guys, I did start La Dieta, so hopefully, you guys are proud of me. You know what I'm saying? Give me a little pat on the back because the boy finally started it again. Just for like, like, I don't know. I mean, at least I started it back, you know what I'm saying? I cheated for like a week or two, you know what I'm saying? It's just kind of whatever I wanted, so like that. It is what it is, you know what I'm saying? Whatever. But I did start the diet today. It felt good to get back at it. I did chest and shoulders for like 45 minutes and then I did the Stairmaster for 30 minutes and it felt so good to get to my my blood pressure going, you know what I'm saying? Get a little pump going and it felt good. So hopefully I can, you know what I'm saying? Get back to it because we are gonna be going to Miami, you guys, in I think like eight days, it's in like a week. So we're pretty excited about that. But I did stop by at this Chinese restaurant. My trainer did tell me that it was pretty bomb and he does go here a lot. It is a Chinese restaurant and they have pretty much like teriyaki chicken, you guys. So it has chicken and rice and it looks like green onions. Hopefully it's good. He said it's good, so. This is a new spot for me, look at this. So it does have the chicken and then it has the white rice right under it. And then it does have a little dog on the side. How am I? Hey, you want some of it too? You like teriyaki bowls or what? Look at him, look at him. No, me chiquito. You have your food down there. Go eat your food. Go eat your foodie. Bonito. So yeah, I literally haven't tried this spot, you guys, because it's like in a different city than we're from. So I had to trust him on this because he is from that city and he was like, you know what, go try out the spot. I usually go there after the gym. It wasn't too far from my gym either, so hopefully it's good. Right now, Stephanie is barely getting up right now. I know. She did start, you know what I'm saying, that time of year and stuff like that so she needs to be a little bit more babied you know what i'm saying a little bit more babied backwards and stuff like that so she's gonna get up right now we're gonna we're supposed to be cleaning the house because it is completely dirty you guys we're supposed to be doing like a whole cleaning spree so that's probably what we're gonna be doing but i just need to eat first get my macros in get my protein get my carbs and stuff like that so and i'm also gonna be drinking this gatorade zero this shit's fire hey guys so look who decided to wake up finally huh as you can see i'm over here being a going we're gonna throw a pizza yet right here that's where we're cleaning the dance floor <laughs> I need a better mop, first of all. This one's hella cheap. We need some better lighting. We need to knock down some walls, <laughs> get some windows. We need something. Oh, you. But yeah, so we're just cleaning. Today's a cleaning day. You know, after Memorial Day weekend shenanigans, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we didn't do shit. So, don't mind me with my chanclas. I know. It's 106 degrees today. It's hot. All. I'm your weather reporter here. It is extremely hot, you guys. We have the, we AC, have the AC cranking and it feels like it's not even on. It feels like it's fucking, we're in a sauna. Like Stephanie said, we are having a little cleaning day today because I feel like we haven't had like a full long cleaning day in a while. We've had like where we clean every once in a while, but it's not like completely just go crazy. You know what I'm saying? Like the unnecessary shit, like scrubbing between walls. You know what I'm saying? Like me over here right now, I am cleaning in between the couches, making sure that there's no Malachi hair, put all the pillows over there, stuff like that. And as well as when you have a Husky, as beautiful as Malachi, 
You have to get a lint roller, you guys, and literally lint roll the couches. This is what we do. That way we make sure that there's like no hair, no unnecessary hair, make sure the couches are clean. So me and Stephanie kind of just split everything, huh, baby? Yeah, I'll do the mopping, he'll do the vacuuming, I'll wash the dishes, you'll like wipe the tables. Yeah, so Malachi over there is gonna be bugging us. That's his job. I think you should take care of the kitchen or what? You take care of the kitchen, I'll take care of the, of the living room or what? Yeah. Sounds like a plan? And then we just like kiss after or what? Why are you still recording me? And then kiss after or what? <laughs> and then kiss after or what? Yeah. Okay, thank you, ma'am. I need a reward. Oh. Love that for you. Love that shit. Lily just got out the gym sweating and I'm here cleaning, sweating. It's a vibe, you guys, but you know what I'm saying? Productive day, you know what I'm saying? Lakers play at seven. It's gonna be a great day. They're gonna win, all right? Right now, it's a tied series, but they're gonna end up winning, you guys. That's why I'm trying to speed clean. That way I can go ahead and just relax, enjoy the game and stuff like that. Stuff has to change around this house because it is dirty, it is messy, so yeah. What's that, yeah? We're a little bit. Oh, girlfriend of mine, let's see. Hey. Oh, When you play your friend's music and it's not copyright, so you can actually leave it in. You know what I'm saying? I love that shit for us. Cause you could be a star, baby. Hey, this song actually slapped, you guys. It's Girlfriends by Joe Maynard. Shit slap. For right now, you guys, I am trying to clean, like, I don't know if you can tell right here. Like, I did clean this part right here already, kind of. But look at compared to this right here, look. You can see, like, some Malachi hairs. See that? Look at that. I literally just go like this, and there's Malachi hairs. But, like, right here is kind of a little bit more cleaner. We do use this Lysol for almost all around the house. It works pretty good, huh? It smells good too, huh, baby? Yeah. Yeah, a hundred. A hundred percent. Yup. You guys saw it right. That's chicken grease going down my, uh, my head right now. Twist it up, you guys. We finished cleaning a little bit more. Stephanie ended up cleaning the floors and left the peanut butter right on the floor. So, I'm saying, love that shit for us. Yeah, she's throwing away all food, but so far, you guys, I mean, cleaning everything, it's looking a lot better. We moved around the carpet, cleaned the carpet like eight times, cleaned around like this. I'm saying clean this. It's looking a lot better. And then like stuff like little things that I told you guys that, we, that we're cleaning right now that we never really cleaned. But, like the white borders right here, like it gets really dirty, but now I kind of cleaned it. It's a lot whiter. Let me show you one that I haven't cleaned. Like right here, guys, you can see it right there. <laughs> That is disgusting. You know what I'm saying? So like all that needs to be cleaned right now. I'm also cleaning these yellow cabinets as well. So like this one I already cleaned right here. You see how clean it looks? And I look at this one right here. It looks all white, like right there. So we need to clean that. Just like the little things that we don't do. Stephanie's throwing away old food, but beer, what are you doing? Yeah, I cleaned the cabinet. I organized it a little bit. Oh really, Chippy Seas? A little bit. Okay, okay. It doesn't look organized because we don't have like containers, but like. Uh -huh. It's organized. Yeah, it looks a lot better, but. You have your. Pelones that I can't eat right now because, you know what I'm saying? La dieta. Yeah. But that salad, yeah, nobody ate that shit, so. <laughs> Just kidding. Now I gotta clean this. It looks clean already or what? Not really? So we're in the car, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna go get some food. We did finish cleaning up. We basically focused a lot on like detailing everything. So, like, obviously we did like the sweeping and the mopping, but we did scrub like walls and like air vents and stuff like that. Also, I scrubbed like the like the backs of the toilets because you guys need to do that. Like for some reason, I don't know how, but it gets dirty, you know what I'm saying? Like it just, I don't know how it just gets dirty back there, but you need to scrub that shit or else it starts smelling hella bad inside of your freaking bathroom. But anyways, we are extremely hungry right now. I think we're gonna go to Chipotle because la dieta. I'm saying Chipotle is pretty freaking bomb. I like it even on days when it's not like a healthier choice. But especially for this guy over here, he does need to eat a little healthier because he is on his like health journey trying to get fit. Me, I'm just making better decisions here and there. So the only thing that sucks though is we're gonna cheat on our diet in Miami though. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, and that's in like a week. But we don't have to cheat on our diet. Come on now, we're gonna go to Miami and eat salads? <laughs> like that ain't a thing, sis. Bro, you can eat like chicken, you can eat veggies. What do you think, guys? Should we travel to Miami and spend thousands of dollars to get there to eat salads or should we cheat on the diet? Let us know in the comments down below. I'm pretty curious about that. You know what I'm saying? Try some new Miami out of state food. I think or... we should try like, um, I think there's like this one spot where it's like Peruvian food or something uh -huh. like that. I want to try that because when we tried it in Vegas, it was pretty freaking bomb, honestly. Like, so we I could kinda... try that instead of eating grass. Yeah, oh, instead of eating rabbit food, is that what yeah, you're trying to say? I don't know. 
Anyway, but yeah, as you guys can tell, I did get kind of ready. Not really. I basically washed only my body because it is still extremely hot. It's only 6 o'clock, so I'm going to wash my hair tonight. But I basically just washed my body, and then I just kind of did my makeup a little bit just to feel better and, like, feel like, you know, I need to get my day started and stuff like that. And then Jesus, he took a whole shower, right? Mm -hmm. Did you? Yeah. But yeah, so we just wanted to refresh ourselves. We took a little break. And now we're ready to freaking eat and enjoy some food because... But it's hot, though. It's 103 degrees outside right is now. It? I know. It's freaking hot right now, you guys. If you guys don't know already, we live in Tulare, the freaking valley. Holy shit, it'd be hot. Like, I understand how, like, my, my deals from, like, Paso and, like, all the Bay areas, how, like, they wouldn't want to be here or live here because they say it's extremely freaking hot. And they don't like that it smells like cows. But honestly, I don't feel like it smells like cows that often. And then the heat, I feel like I've just gotten used to it, like, so much. But I kind of like the heat. I'd rather, I prefer the summertime than the winter. Because the winter, I'm just too cold, too frozen. I don't want to do anything. You most likely get sick. Like, what the hell? But I prefer the summertime. Just go swimming, you know, eat a popsicle. I don't know. Drink a margarita. This is like, what? <laughs> what do you prefer? Do you prefer summer or winter? Summer for sure. But Why? I don't know. I just like summer outfits better. You like summer outfits? Yeah. It's like more chill. I don't know. Love that. It's not raining and shit. Like raining. you don't like to like layer, huh? Well, I feel like raining is depressing. Like I just want to like cry. Yeah. Rain, the rain time, like when it's like cold season, the time is changed. Like it gets darker faster. Oh yeah. I just cry. I don't like every that. Night. It's like, like depression just, time. Yeah, it's depressing. But anyway, we'll see you guys when we get our Chipotle because I think we're just rambling because we're like super hungry. But yeah, anyway. Finally made it, you guys. Super excited because I'm hungry Candy after cleaning. Rice. And then black tea. Let's see what Stephanie gets. White rice and black beans. White rice and black beans. Um, no meat. My meat. Uh -huh. Can I do a uh, white rice, pinto, and chicken? It's kind of fresh in here, actually. It feels yeah, great. It feels great. I get no meat, guys. Uh, it'd be too much. For that one, I'll just do sour cream, cheese, guac, and lettuce. Is that meat? No meat. Alright, be careful with that bag, you know what I'm saying? That is the bag of many happiness. Yeah. This is just me, does anybody else just get like really excited when you guys get food? Since when do we have a UPS store? I don't know. Do you see that right there? Since we actually cared? No. I know, right? Since we actually like realized that there's a UPS store and then we actually care. So I don't know if you guys remember earlier in the video or I don't know if you guys' memory just went complete blank. What? But early in the video we did watch A Quiet Place 2. We didn't do a review on it. We're not gonna do any spoilers, all right? So if you guys wanna watch the movie, go watch it. I recommend it. I think both of the movies are solid. What do you think, Bobe? I honestly think they're pretty cool. I feel like I can't breathe when I watch the movies. Like, I feel like I can't, like, make noise. Yeah, no, exactly. But, like, and, and the crazier part was that, like, I guess we paid. I didn't even know, because, like, our friends bought the tickets. Our friends paid for, it was, like, the luxury seat. And then as well as, like, I think it's DFX. It's like extra sound, like the yeah, sound quality there, is there was a lot of points in the movie where I was like, like it was so like scary and like loud, and you the, know? It's just funny though because like, so it's meant to be quiet, right? The movie's called A Quiet Place, they're completely quiet, then all of a sudden, bah, like something like hella loud, you guys. It's just like a loud bang, so then that throws you off guard. But after a while, I feel like we caught on, huh? We were yeah, kind of like, I like, was expecting of, it, I was like. Yeah, instead of being like complete still, I was like. I gotta like loosen up because there's about to be a scary part yeah. and then I still get scared. Yeah, like, oh, I had to like God. breathe. But what was cool about it was we did end up ordering food, right? So we got like fries, we got boneless wings, we got popcorn. And it was pretty cool because I didn't know that they do this, but they like bring your food to you when the food is ready. Like they bring it into your movie theater as you're sitting down. And I thought that was pretty cool. I never had that experience. I'm pretty sure it's been there or they've been doing that for a little bit, but yeah. I couldn't remember. But I thought that was pretty cool. That was nice. And they upgraded the seats. They like, upgraded the seats. It's like brand new seats, so that's cool. And then as well as you do have to have a mask on at all times. There is people that come by and like look, but as long as you're eating something, you don't really have to wear your mask. So like I was eating popcorn for most of the time, so I didn't really- And the nothing. slushy and all and that the slushy. Stuff. Oh my God, I was having a blast. Yesterday was literally my last cheat day, you guys. So I just went in. I think yeah. after that, what did we eat? Popeyes, huh? Yeah. We ate Popeyes, so it's just like, I don't know. It was pretty crazy. I went on the Stairmaster today, you guys, for like 30 minutes. And I were, burned like 300 calories or something like that. You about every single fry you had or No, what? I was sweating extra. I think it was all that chicken grease. That's what I'm saying. I think it was all that Popeyes. <laughs> all that Popeyes, that biscuit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but it was a good run, you know what I'm saying? Nice little two weeks of cheating, so. But here we are with our Chipotle. Chipotle's great. You got your protein, 
Yeah. Chipotle's still fire. Like, even how Stephanie said, like, it's just fire. But back to the movie, I definitely recommend to you guys go watch it. The only thing that I did not like about the movie was that it was only an hour and a half. So you didn't like how it ended? I didn't like that it was an hour and a half. I feel like it should have been at least two hours and a half. Another hour at least. You know what I mean? I feel like it ended short. But you can tell that there's going to be a, a third movie. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to spoil anything. But for sure, huh? There's going to be a third movie. I based on what happened? Yeah, based on what happened, it's like, okay, wait, what's going to happen then? So it's yeah. almost like, I feel like, or we feel like there's going to be a third movie, a part three, because of, like, the ending. So I'm just like... Damn, and I'm I was, kind of excited. And I was telling Stephanie that like this movies are like so good that I feel like it could be a TV show based on like, you know what I'm saying? The the events that happened. I think it'd be a lit ass TV show, but who knows? Here we go, you guys. Clean house check. I don't know why it looks so dirty. I mean, it doesn't look dirty, but <laughs> you just doesn't go. Look dirty, right? doesn't look dirty, but you know what I'm saying? We had to clean the carpets. I cleaned the carpets like almost twice, three times. We do need to get like the, the washer carpet. What do you call it? Carpet washer? Yeah. Carpet washer and wash the carpets because we do do that like what? Once every two months or something like that. Something like that. <laughs> but for some reason, like our couch goes on top of our carpet, right? Like this other carpet that we bought, it was making like like a crease a crease on it it was like kind of weird like i don't know if i can explain it you guys can kind of see right there you see that the line it was kind of like lifting it and it was like that like i don't know i, I don't think know. it's because as we sit down on the couch for some reason we just keep like pushing it uh -huh. so then the carpet just moves yeah that's what so. i'm saying like even right here look it's it's already moving kind of like that you see that it's like a trail for like yeah. dirt bikes so i don't know maybe there's something we could put underneath i feel like i've seen that before what? i just think it's because it's only like stuck on like that yeah i don't know i don't know you didn't bring my Maui? You didn't bring in my kind? I'm waiting for you to show them. Damn, guys, and I freaking cleaned the windows too. Let's see if he dirtied them. Oh, we don't have our carpets. Hey, who has wet patas? Look, all of our carpets are drying right now too, guys, so. Hey, we don't bring you Chipotle. You have your food right there, look. You have your food right there. Eat it, chulo boy. But that is gonna be a wrap for today's video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. It's a little bit more chill vibes, you know what I'm saying? We really didn't have anything, yeah, cleaning vibes. We really didn't have anything to do these last two days. Just because I had to work yesterday and then we had plans with our friends and then today we just really wanted to clean, so yeah. that's that. Hopefully you guys enjoyed these type of vlogs. Uh, let us know in the comments down below if you guys enjoy cleaning, just whatever type of vlogs. Or do you guys like us to go out and like spend a bag, $30, you guys know, and uh, just go out, like let us know, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but, it was very much needed. I felt like we had to do this, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, no, this was needed for sure. Before we end today's video, we do have to do a post notification shout out, which is going to who movie? So today's post notification shout out goes to Natalie Giron. Shout out to you. Whoever else would like a post notification shout out, all you have to do is subscribe to our channel, turn on the bell, and then comment when you're done. But without further ado, thank you so much for watching. We love you guys. I'll see, see you guys, guys next time. time. Peace. Peace.